Okay. Hello, Virgo. Welcome to your horoscope. All right. So, scene, scene, scene. Okay, so Scorpio is actually a really good friend of Virgo. You know, third house is often about friendship, at least siblings, friends we made when we were in elementary school, high school, even college um, is all in that third house. Mercury's been there, so your communication's been good. It's going to change. It's going to the fourth house. Mercury in your fourth house will help sharpen up your memory. Might improve your relationship with your parents, older adults. Help you be more intelligent about how you use energy in your household. Um, but the riches, you know, the theme of riches for 2017, the end of 2017 and most of 2018 is going to be friendships. And it's going to be... Um, thoughtful, uplifting, spiritual words versus exaggeration. It's going to be art. It's going to be working with your hands. And um, this is the perfect time to get engaged and to incubate all those great creative ideas and, and start to manifest. Um, you have um, Neptune in the seventh house. So it's like, you know, if you were single... And, you know, you're looking for a mate. It's really hard to be clear about what's going on. But if you're looking for someone to make a spiritual connection with, that's deeper than just, you know, hey, we lust over each other really well. Man, something good could happen. Um, you know, and, and, you know, you have your own fetishes and ideas about how things should roll. I mean, this full moon is going to bring good fortune to you, actually. You're, you're going to do really good. There's, there's some blessings coming down on you. And Lord knows you could really use them right now. I know you've been through hell and back recently, some of you, and um, it's nice to have you back. 